Hello everyone. So in this section, we will understand the features of the opportunity. Okay. Now we know how to create an opportunity and how to create an opportunity from the lead section. Uh, now let's understand. Let's explore it more and understand what are the different features that are available for it. Okay. Now we can after after we have created an opportunity. Now uh, every opportunity needs to be assigned to someone, right? So we can also create an auto assignment rule. So from that, uh, an op whenever a new opportunity is created, it, it can be assigned to different users. All right. So let's uh, let's just go through the assignment rule, and then we can get straight into it. Now this is the assignment rule. Now let's create one more. Okay. So we can name uh, we can name that as an let's say opportunity one all right and this this is the document type so we can see there are different types of document over here so if it is lead source and um, this is all the automated work right so we'll just select the opportunity and CRM we can see all right so description is automatic assignment of an opportunity right yes so now we can assign the conditions over here and we can also unassign the conditions and then we can also close the conditions so let's just go to assigning the condition okay now suppose um, we want to assign the opportunity uh, if the status of the opportunity is open as soon as it's open right so let's just create a condition that status equals to equals to open all right then only we will be able to create um, this uh, assignment will be done all right now we can also mention a close condition but for now let's just select uh, consider this particular condition all right now this is the days uh, the days uh, indicate the day on which the assignment can be done so let's just add one more day um, delete this day and we'll just consider oh my god okay tuesday okay so since today is tuesday so we want to see how it works all right so assignment day is tuesday all right now there are two different rules that is round robin and then there is a load balancing so if we are selecting round robin then if uh, there are like suppose multiple users so um, suppose i'm adding some okay and then i'm adding all right let's just um okay suppose i'm adding okay yeah so uh, what will happen over here is that all this uh, assignment will be done one by one okay now if i select load balancing then what will happen is if uh, either of them have the lowest assignments done so they will get it first all right so let's uh, go with round robin because it's better just save it okay now opportunity one has been done okay now let's create an opportunity and see how it works All right, let's create a new opportunity and we'll see the assignment. All right, now the opportunity is from a lead. Let's select a lead as, okay, David Rose. All right, and let's just save it. As soon as we save it, we'll, we should get the message that this particular uh, has been shared to a following user. All right, so let's just close it. So this was about the uh, auto assignment of the opportunity okay now let's say if you want to close an opportunity so what we'll do is we'll go to the selling list selling settings yes so here we can see that there is an option to close an opportunity after certain days so basically after 15 days this particular opportunity will be closed okay so we'll just save it and understand how it how okay okay no changes made in the document all right no problem so yes this was about this was about uh, 
about the different features of the opportunity and thank you so much for watching